Hey guys, in this video, I'm gonna show you 10 new must-have applications for Android devices. So the first application here is Switcher. This application lets you to switch between your recent application with a single swipe. Slide your fingers from the left corner of your screen, then you will have a list of your recent application and you can easily switch between them. It's a lot like all plus tab in PC. This application works in top of every application. It's a much faster way to multitask the dedicated multitasking button. There are two different styles that you can choose from, switcher flow and switcher slide. Inside of this application, you will have various settings like you can sense the sensitivity and to sense various things like background opacity, speed and various effects. So that's all about this application. This app makes multitasking more efficient and effective. So the next application here is SwiftKey. The new version of SwiftKey comes with many new features. Now you can undock your keyboard and move it all over the screen. There are various sizes which you could choose from and there are three different modes. Full mode, that's like the normal mode, thumb mode for two hand uses and the compact mode better for one hand uses. There are many themes that you could choose from and li like all the previous version of SwiftKey you have the swap feature that you could use and the predictions of this keyboard is very accurate. SwiftKey allows you to back up your data online so you could use it in various devices. So that's all about this application just give this app a try it's much better than the stock keyboard. The next application on the list is Startup Manager. Startup Manager helps users to disable apps to start as a device boots. There are many applications which start as a device boots up but you don't need most of the applications. Here in my phone, here's a list of applications that starts as my phone boots up and I don't need most of the applications. This application are using my RAM thus reducing phone's overall performance. By tapping on the minus icon here, you can disable the application and with this application, you can also disable the system app. So that's all about this application. This application does what it needs to do with no other tool inside of it. It's a very lightweight application. The next application is Little Photo. It's a simple photo editing app which is very easy to use. This application has 70 different awesome effects like Lomo, black and white, faded and many more. There are also various tools inside of, the, of this application to add text, draw, adding clip art and many more. In the tool section here you have option to add text, draw, art paint is one of the best tools as you can add various shapes there are many other tools here. Images render very quickly in this application. This application has got lots of effect and awesome tools to make your photos look perfect. That's all about this application. This app is very fun and simple to use. The next application here is DU Battery Saver. DU Battery Saver is likely to work better than most built-in power saving options. This application has advanced features to get the most out of your battery. By pressing the optimize button, it shows you the app consuming high power and recommended settings to increase your battery life. In saver mode, there are several modes, so according to your requirement, you could choose your mode. While you are not using your phone, switch to sleep mode so that you will get the most out of your battery. There is an option to create your own mode too. From here you can charge your battery in a way it gives maximum uses. It tracks and implements charging on your phone. From the monitor option, you could see which application is using what percentage of your battery. This application also has some widgets to make things easy. So that's all about this application. It's one of the best power battery saving application. The next application is Slide Home. You will have a little circle on the corner of your screen which would launch you an app menu with app of your choices. You could add 10 different apps and have access to it very fast. This application works in top of every application so you can easily launch your favorite app. 
there are 12 tiles, 10 app, 1 message and setting. In top, you can add a number of your own choice. You can also move the circle and choose to have a different icon instead of a circle. So that's all about this application. It's a very useful application. The next app here is Pulse. It's a news application. This application allows you to customize your news reading experience. In this application, you can add your favorite sources from which you want to receive news. And your sources are displayed on the screen in an organized manner. You can view a large amount of content on your screen managed very simply. To read any news, simply tap on it. There are many sources available which are distributed in various categories. You can choose to have as many sources as you want. After signing in, you can discuss what's trending with others. Sharing is also very easy in this application. The UI of this application is very easy to use and everything is managed in an intuitive way. So that's all about this app. The next application here is called Popout. If you are playing a game and someone calls you, you would expect for the new window to open. But with this application, an incoming call won't interrupt while you are playing or reading. It shows the number in a small circle. Touching it will give you more options like accepting the call, silencing it and rejecting it. From settings, you can change how the circle is going to look and you can also choose in which application you want this feature and in, and in which application you, won't want the, you don't want this feature. So that's all about this app. The next app here is Mercury Browser. Mercury Browser is a fast and elegant browser with just all the features you need. This browser is very fast. In a new tab, you will have all your saved bookmarks displayed and navigating through tabs is very easy. It doesn't have any fancy transition effect which would slow down your phone. Controls are very simple. The view mode, the texture view, mobile view, iPad view. There's a private mode. There are many more options like you can switch between day night mode, lock rotation, change font size. In this browser, you can add various plugins like AdBlock so you won't have any annoying ads displayed. Wi-Fi file transfer to transfer files with Wi-Fi wirelessly. That's all about this application. This app is very fast and has all the features. So just give it a try. The last application on the list is Buy Me A Pie. Buy Me A Pie is a list making app that's very simple to use. The best feature is that you can use same list in multiple devices and the list updates in real time. When you make change in one of the device, it shows in other. There is a list of items pre-listed in this application. After that item is finished, simply tap on it to remove it from the list. If the item is not listed, you can write and with your own quantity. You can long tap to edit an item. You can sync this application between phones of various platforms. So that's all about this application. This app is very simple to use. So that's all on top 10 best must have applications for Android devices. If you have any other application on mind, do comment below. And do subscribe for more videos and do like this video if this video helped you. Thanks for watching. Have a nice day.